Well, it's Christmas time here at Stowe Hill. It's the 23rd of December, and here's a lovely boat. She's called Yoon Hakil. That's Cornish. It means straight and narrow, apparently. I've taken advice on that, as well as the pronunciation. So, um, if you disagree, then let me know. Yoon Hakil, she's a 57-foot reverse-style cruiser stern narrowboat built in 2009 by Cheshire Narrowboat. She was fitted out by the original owner and she's such a lovely boat she's been home to the current owner for the last 10 years since she was bought in the first place so she's fully tried and tested from that point of view. Gas bottles are in the forward locker there very good condition cratch cover over the well deck. There's 300 watts of solar panels on the roof there they're tilting ones and the pram hood as well is in very good condition. Creates a nice little covered area if you're living aboard on the back deck for drying dogs or keeping a coal on the winter. The engines under these deck boards here, that's a Beta 38. Regularly serviced, last serviced in um, December 2019. Comfortable seat across the back deck there. Very good sized stern deck, over six feet long. And down into the boat we go. Reverse style, as I said, so the galley is first. Very good size room, this. She's nine feet long in the galley. Pine tongue and groove above the gunnels there. And there's a cupboard here, the washing machine there. That's a Zanussi 1300 Aqua Cycle. Stainless steel sink. And plenty of cupboard space under the surface areas in this side of the kitchen. Cupboards either side of the stairs, fuse isolation switches in there and over here. Other various bits of electricery and then here's the inverter, that's a master volt 2.5 kilowatt inverter. So plenty of 230 volt supply. Fridge here, that's new, that was new this year, it's an Ice King 230 volt, further cupboard space. And the cooker and oven again were new this year. Full burner gas hob oven and grill with drawers next to it. The floor in here is wood laminate. There's the view back down the galley. Lovely space. And into the saloon. This room is huge. It's 18 feet long. Very open plan. All the furniture is freestanding. There's a very large side hatch there on the starboard side. Head height on the boat is six foot three. All the lighting on board is LED. There's a nice wing back armchair there with a sofa bed. Both sitting opposite the solid fuel stove. That's an arrow. There's a drop down dining table. That just folds down. There's a bracket underneath with two dining chairs. And a desk at the end. Underneath the wall mounted 24 inch DVD TV. Another radiator there. Central heating on board is a Wabasto diesel fired system. The bathroom's next. The loo is a Thetford cassette. There's two spare cassettes on board. The, this has all been redone in here this year. The basin there is ceramic. Very good sized shower cubicle with a glass bifold door. Tiled. Lovely room. And the bedroom's in the forward cabin. The, the double bed, six feet two long, four foot six wide, and there is a huge amount of storage underneath. I'm lifting this with one hand with the camera in the other, so that shows how easy it is. Just lifts up to expose acres of storage. Bank of four drawers here. And there's a wardrobe at either side of the steps as you go out onto the well deck. She's such a lovely boat, she's full of character actually. Credentials for living aboard are tried and tested. Satellite dish you see there, there is free sat on board that goes with the television. Huge bank of batteries, five 110 amp hour batteries, they were all new in 2019. Hot water is supplied by the engine all of the diesel fired with Basto system and she was last blacked in November 2018 she's been blacked every two years since since she was launched so the hull's in very good condition and she comes with all the 
necessary navigation equipment to just turn the key and go. There's Bob and Maureen in their Santa hats. So that's Yunha Keel. For further photographs, a fully downloadable colour brochure and the spec and the price, go to our website www.rugbyboats.co.uk.